This one I call push the line because if you look, I'm kind of pushing the line out of the way. After moving to Arizona, I had to find a new type of exercise that actually excited me. I didn't know where to start, so I just jumped in my wheelchair and decided to start pushing around the neighborhood. I started to notice that there was a unique relationship between the road, my wheelchair, and my body. One of the most unique outcomes of this is it has actually improved my walking. This technique is all about finding balance. Once you find the dead center of the road, just make little tiny adjustments by moving your weight in certain directions. Like I can go like this, I'll go that way. I can go like this, I go this way. All you really need to be able to do is to move your hands in just a little infinity pattern. And it's just gonna automatically do it for you. And the more comfortable you get recentering your chair without having to touch the wheels, the more you can make your movements bigger and bigger and bigger. I'm imagining that the wheels on my right side are just like my right leg and the wheels on my left side are just like my left leg. So I can kind of, I've spent so many hours pushing around this neighborhood that I basically understand each one of these cracks like the back of my hand. Below my belly button is where my paralysis line begins. So my glutes, quads, hamstrings, calves, and feet are all impaired. And by using this wheelchair as a device to connect with the road, they are literally starting to re-engage and activate and my mind is blowing. So this little one is just like you're riding on a balance beam. You're making itty bitty corrections at the very, very top while some of your wheels are on one side of the crack and your other two wheels are on the other side of the crack. Once you get strong enough to push fast enough and you feel like you're really balanced on the line, you can become a little more liberal and a little more movement based. I got my hips in this one. I'm kind of moving my arms in a little bit bigger of a circle. This next one is gonna be more of a carve. There's a lot of knees in it. It's real smooth. I'm trying to push as much pressure into the tire as possible, really trusting it to hook and move where I want it to. This next one, we're using a lot of the same arm techniques, but we're throwing in a lot of hip and core for even more deep control. This one I call push the line because if you look, I'm kind of pushing the line out of the way. This one requires a lot of velocity and speed, but by the time I reach the bottom of the hill, hopefully it's gonna look like I'm about to run out of my chair. Okay, pushing the line, pushing the line, getting more depth, fists. Okay, look at this. Is this not like feel like you're running? Look at me. I'm running straight to the camera. I feel like I could run right out of here. I know when I first got paralyzed, I was trying to avoid the wheelchair with everything in my soul because I believe that getting a wheelchair was submitting to the fact that this injury had won. But the reality is this wheelchair, when used correctly, can be used as a rehabilitation tool that I don't think any of us saw coming. If you've enjoyed this video or learned anything from it, please be sure to hit that like button and smash that subscribe.